So you have race menu installed and now you want to install some presets. Well, let's go to this tab right here, High Poly Skyrim Girls. And you're ready to just press the files button right here and press the mod manager download button right here and just install them and just load them in race menu. Well, I'm going to show you why it's important in this video to also install, da -da -da, go down here, the required mods, specifically the race menu plugins. Now, I'm Bekofi and I hope that I can help you in this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, yes, pop down in the comment section. It may seem like, oh, there's so much of this, but I'm going to show you what it looks like without the plugins installed, okay? Alright guys, so we're in game now without plugins, right? And you have a very limited selection of hairstyles to choose between. So all vanilla, you have, you have like, you know, you can be a punk if you want to, like a punk, let's go. Then you load a preset, let's say, Crusa, right? This is not what she's supposed to look like. Now same goes for the body paint. I have the chainmail shorts installed, but it's just purple. It's because the plugin isn't installed. So if I want to get rid of the purple stuff, I can take away the transparency. Right. So now we fix that issue. All right. So now that you've seen that, well, how do we actually install these? You know, we want these installed. So before anything, I'll assume that you have either Vertex or Mod Organizer installed. These are both Mod Managers. So let's just open link in new tab, you can uh, right click, you can skip this one, it's a bit advanced. Uh, right click, just right click, just right click all of these things. Let's go over to these tabs then. Right, now let's, let's make it simple, just click the Vertex button right here. Slow down now. Vertex. Just download. Oh, this one doesn't have that, but then just go to files right here. Files, and then click on Mod Manager Download. That's the exact same as pressing on Vertex. Uh, if you don't have Vertex installed, it's just gonna go to Mod Organizer. It's, it's not, you know, a difference. Now let's, you know, do the same for the rest here. I really like Wolf Paint. It's a very nice mod. You get some face tattoos with this one. It's really cool. And also the, you know, the freckles are pretty cool. And everything is cool, you know. And then you hop on over here to the mod organizer platform. And you can see here in the downloads tab that it's downloading. Then you double click. This one is already done. So double click the Ice of Beauty. You install it. And I already have it installed, so, you know, cancel. <laughs> I'm gonna show you here in my list. Uh, we all have different ways of sorting, right? So this is how I do it. Um, here I have the category, character creation. And I have some race menu, body slide, high poly head, so on. And then below I have race menu plugins here. KS Hardos, Apache Hair, Eyes of Beauty, Mikan Eyes. And to be honest, I don't use Apache hair for my characters, like, ever. Uh, I mostly use KS Hardos, so you could just skip the, this one, but I have it installed, because maybe you want to, you know, download presets made by other people, not just my presets. And in that case, like, you know, it's good to have all of the different plugins. All right, so we're in game with all of the plugins specified in the mod page installed. And now this is my newest character, Wicket. And if we go then to, let's say, eyes, you can choose between the eyes of beauty and the Mikan eyes. If we look down here to the right down corner, right, you're going to see what mod it is you're loading. Let's see if I choose eye color set 26 on the list, 25. I'm gonna get female eyes, human mist, female eyes, human marin. Just as a side note, like you don't actually need to install eye plugins because you can also choose to just uh, 
have the vanilla ice and then retexture them to look better. I've done both. So I have plugins which gives me more eye options and I have retextured the vanilla ice. But when it comes to hair, you know, you should definitely install KS hair dots because look, look, you get, you get so much to choose between, right? Also, let's check out body paint. I have uh, the Shane Mail installed here. So I go to face paint. Here we have the Wolf paint tattoo, right? It's pretty cool. You can also get this one, this one, yeah. And you can make it bloody. You can change the color. So, there are a lot of different things we can do with uh, race menu plugins. And I hope that this video has helped you. Yeah, she's all happy now, you know, yay. <laughs> race menu plugins, yay. <laughs> if you have more questions or suggestions, pop down in the comment section and also don't forget to leave a like. Alright, that's it. Just big, please.